What is going on, everybody? Azario here, and welcome to another ADS Play cha channel update, the ADS Play uploading schedule series, where, of course, I talk about the upcoming games, uh, any current events going on, updates as to what I'm going to be doing, um, et cetera, et cetera. So, as you know, we're in the festive season. This is the, this is the holidays, you know, and this is where, where things start to get... Um, you know, this is where pretty much like the year end videos begin to come out around this time toward the end uh, so first off I would like to person no, I'm, I'm gonna just get this out the way now I'm not gonna say um to say this later on I'm gonna say this now thank you to everybody who has subscribed to this channel and people who have helped me accomplish things on this channel just by you viewing um I don't know who's been doing it, but somebody's been getting the word out about my channel, and I've noticed a growth that at the beginning of this year, you know, it may not have been as fast of a growth as I would think anybody would want, but I'm still happy for the growth because I feel like mine is organic. It comes from, you know, a genuine place because people really do want to watch the content. Um, I've gotten more consistent views over this year and I do want to thank and I want to emphasize on that more when the year end video comes out but this channel earlier this year had around like 1300 subscribers we're at we're damn near at 2000 so that's always going to be a good thing we have over 3 million views which is you know which is a blessing I'll take that you know thank you very much and I hope you guys continue to support me in the future because we have a lot of exciting things coming up and I'm going to get into that right now, actually. So, first off, let me just touch on this. For those of you who know and been paying attention to my Twitter, I have been avidly promoting my esports team, an esports team that I'm, I'm making from ground up. This is my logo. Got it copyrighted, trademarked, all that good stuff. Um, and now I'm making fan shirts for anybody who wants to support the, um, the team because I do plan on, in 2018, going to various tournaments. Um, trying to get the 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 name out there of, of War Warriors Collective, which is the name of my esports team that I'm creating, and you know I'm just trying to get the name out there to try to help uh, promote the team, and hopefully in the future uh, like recruit more members and turn this into an actual entity. You know, um, this started as a Facebook group, you know, that I created back in like 2000. I, I want to say 2010, 2011, but I, I didn't really do anything with it. So everything I had planned for that Facebook group, that's what I'm bringing to life now. And, you know, the T-shirts are out. You know, it's still got nine days left. This is a 15-day a campaign um, at, on Teespring. You see the name right here. Just go to Teespring, type in World Warriors Collective Esports. And, uh, you know, they got T-shirts for men and women. Um, you know, these are all the designs I have, all the colors I have right now. Um, right now, I'm working on getting uh, new designs for the shirts. These are the women tees right here. These are relaxed fit uh, tees. You know, like I tried to get the most... Um, economically priced t-shirts that they had available on teespring and these this is as cheap as i can i can make them while making a profit because all the proceeds are going towards helping you know get to tournaments and hotel reservation you know all that while still showing your support so head to teespring.com type in war warriors collective esports and rep the warrior in you that's the hashtag so anybody who gets a t-shirt i want you know I want you guys to take a picture and type in war, hashtag World Warriors Collective, hashtag Rep the Warrior in you, and let me see you guys showing support because I really do, I really would like to see that. I think that'd be cool. Uh, last but not least, uh, as far as the non-gaming news, um, as you guys know, I've been doing a, a lot more live streams these days. Um, and I'm debating whether or not I want to keep the live streams either on YouTube or Twitch going on next year. Um, I know Twitch has gotten a lot of um, new features in that I wanted to 
implement some of those myself. However, as you guys know, I was waiting on, uh, waiting on, waiting to get a new laptop, and uh, but I had to put the stop in that tracks because you know obvious reasons. Um, for those who are familiar with it, I did get fired from my job, um, and I have been, you know, trying to, you know, maintain. Because this laptop can't really handle a lot of the things I want to do. Um, like I'm trying to run OBS Studio. The laptop is outdated for that. Like it, it can't run the program consistently. Um, and things of that nature. So I can't really do a lot of the things that I want to because of that. So hence the reason why I have the streamlabs.com slash ADS play. The link is in the description. It's a it's a link to give donations for those who, who have been wanting to. You know, this is gonna go towards helping me get that laptop. Originally I wanted to get like a get one that was the same size as the one I have now, which is um which is a seventeen point three inches. Like I believe that's the that's the size it is. And it seems like 15.6 inches is like the best way to go because they charge you the hell out of for that for those extra couple of inches <laughs> like they bump that price up like a hell of a lot. But at this point, I, I just want a new laptop that can maintain the programs and run the programs that I need to run without running the risk of crashing or the program crashing or, you know, any nonsense like that. So that's all I'm I'm aiming for. So a 15.6 size laptop is good just as long as it's powerful and it can run everything that i need it to run so that's what the donations are going towards please help help out where you can and uh it's much much appreciated because i got some pretty interesting things coming up in the future so thank you guys so without further ado let's get to the to the good stuff let's get to the games now this week we have a couple games coming out and I think these are the last two that actually are announced for the month of December. We have Dead Rising 4, Frank's Big Package, and we have Tokyo Xanadu. I don't have, I don't know what the fuck Tokyo Xanadu is. Wow, fuck. I didn't mean to say that, but I don't know what the hell Tokyo Xanadu is. EX Plus, if this is like a sequel to a game or whatever it is. I hope it's not one of those audio novels. It doesn't seem like one. Um, again, just like uh, just just like with, with games like Blue Reflection, just like with other games I've played in the past that turned out to be good, this seems like it could possibly be another one of those. Like just looking at it makes it seem like I can actually enjoy this. Um, the animation looks good, and normally games like this have good gameplay mechanics. So I'm kind of interested in uh, in trying it out and seeing what it is. Um, so that's basically it. Though they're not showing too much gameplay in the trailer. It's just like an anime scene. But most definitely it seems interesting enough to where I can say, okay, let me, let me give it a try. I think it's going to be a pretty fun game. And plus, it'll give us something to do during the downtime for the rest of this month. Because the next game we have coming out, um, let me see. I think the next games won't be out until like December 19th when Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memory, which is part two of the Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth uh, series, which I did play the original. And then we got, you know, Dragon Ball Z Fighters coming next month. We got Monster Hunter World coming next month. We got Dissidia in excuse me tn coming um next month uh, or nt or is it nt or is it tn i don't know nt so i'm you know looking forward to all these games coming out not to and then the month that you know like there's so much coming out next month they got four four big titles coming out next, well three for sure that i know people are looking forward to and that's the the, the last three coming out that month but we got four games coming out next month. They're going to be very big, so I want to get in, enjoy what few games I have now and just try to finish those up before next month gets here. And um, all the donations is going to help maintain everything else I got going on. Uh, so that's pretty much it. Um, 
You know, because like I said, I am looking for work, unemployment insurance, uh, like unemployment benefits. I am, you know, I, I do have a phone interview with those people coming. And uh, I, I'm trying to see how, you know, how that's going to work out for me. Um, but I'm still looking for work. I, I'm like my body's still going through shock. Like I'm, uh, I'm still waking up early in the morning. <laughs> you know what I mean? As if I'm going to, you know, my job. But you know, I, I lost that, and it was through no fault of my own. That's the sad thing about, it. dude. Do you know how my bank card got blocked somehow? And that was like my only way to get to work, and I, I ended up getting fired because of that. So it's just like, you know, I don't know. I, I've already spoke on it. You know, if you guys watch, you know, the special videos that I put out every once in a while. Matter of fact, let me scroll down so you guys can see just ex where exactly that is. But yeah, I. I released a sp a um, special video, I think the day of or the day after it happened, and I already put it out. Let me see. Number two. Where was that? No, no, it was before Halloween. It was after Halloween. Where is it? Like, like the name of it is called. I got fired. Let me see if I can find it. That way you guys can see the name of it for yourself, and you can just go search it. Yeah, right here. I was fired. Oh, oh, all right. So this actually happened the same day that it happened. So yeah, man. Like it was like a tough pill to swallow. Like, I don't even know how to deal with that myself. But I did explain it thoroughly, and it's just one of those devastating things because I'm still kind of shaken up by that. So, but it is what it is, though. So. That is everything, people. Um, thank you guys for watching. Again, T-shirts on Teespring, World Warriors Collective Esports. They're going for $20. They got nine more days until the campaign is over. They got several colors. Please go there, show your support, buy a T-shirt, um, and rep the warrior in you. I want to see you guys with with pictures of your T-shirts to show that you actually you know, are supporting. Um, if not, guys, leave donations. That's another way you can do it. I'd rather you buy a t-shirt because at least that way I know that you're getting something out of it. Like, you're not just giving me money. I mean, unless you're doing it out the kindness of your heart, of course. But, yeah. T-shirts on sale. I got the link on my channel right there in the banner. I got the Teespring link right there. Teespring shirts. And also got the donation link like right there on the side of it. Right there. Boom. So that's everything, man. So thank you guys for watching. Peace. Again, uh, subscribe to the channel to be updated on all the content. Rate all the videos if you care to do that. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. And um, thank you very much. Until next time, peace. And I'll see you guys for gameplay this week.